We're going to turn now to that shocking moment at Sunday's NFL game in Kansas City. Some hometown fans actually cheered when the Chiefs quarterback was knocked flat with an injury and one of his teammates is fighting back, comparing those hecklers to the crowds at the Coliseum in Rome. Josh is back with the latest on this story. And Josh, this has sparked a lot of soul searching in Kansas City. Indeed, it has a lot of people wondering just what happened there. On Sunday, Kansas City fans critical of their quarterback, Matt Castle's performance on the field of late. But when he took that hit during a game against the Ravens over the weekend, the fans' reaction may have crossed the line as teammates are firing back. Castle got drilled in the play. Yeah, he's in real trouble here as he was rocked. Embattled Kansas City quarterback Matt Castle was pummeled during Sunday's Chiefs-Ravens game and lay motionless on the ground before leaving the game with a concussion. And while faint on TV, it sounded as if the home team's disgruntled fans were cheering the injury. I've never been more embarrassed in my life to play football than in that moment. After the loss, his teammate, Eric Winston, lashed out. We got 70,000 people cheering that he got knocked out. I think it's sickening and disgusting. We are not gladiators, and this is not the Roman Coliseum. This is a game. By Monday afternoon, Winston's off-the-cuff candor had gone viral. His rebuke being replayed and analyzed on our sister network, ESPN. Where's the civility? Where's the compassion? But what may be most surprising, this morning Kansas City fans are firing back and not in solidarity with Winston, but in anger, accusing him of unfairly lumping hardcore Chiefs loyalists with a few rude fans. You're just saying, I don't want this guy throwing a football for me anymore. I don't think anybody was wishing yeah. that he was injured. And on Twitter overnight, Winston thanked supporters, tweeting, I stand by what I said. I believe what I said, while admitting 70,000 fans may not have cheered the injury, but that even one was one too many. Now, Castle is expected to miss the Chiefs' next game against Tampa Bay this weekend. There were questions about whether people may have been clapping, actually, as he walked off the field under his own power. It need to be said, Kansas City Chiefs fans among the very best in the sport. Hard to believe that anybody was celebrating an injury. Yeah, that is hard to believe. Josh, thanks so much.